In this video we show how you can design a UX component uh, for a mobile application where you have a list control uh, that has multiple layouts and you automatically select the appropriate layout on an orientation change. So you can see here if we go into a working preview inside our mobile simulator. Currently we're simulating um, the um, mobile um, application when it's in um, lands in portrait mode so our, we have a vertical orientation right now and you can see that our list looks like this is using a freeform layout but if we now change to a horizontal layout we can see that the same list data is still uh, displayed but now we have a columnar layout so we've switched automatically from one list layout to another list layout based on the orientation of the device so let's go now and look at how we did that so we go back to design mode and go to our list here and we can see that we have a uh, simple list that's just based on static data but of course the list could be arbitrarily complex based on DBF or SQL or um, custom um, um, data series etc. So then we go to our list properties and we can see how there we specify that this list has multiple layouts and then we've gone over here and defined uh, the two layouts. We have a columnar layout which uh, uses a, a column layout style and then another layout called freeform which uses a freeform layout style. Then we've gone to the list layout section here and defined the layout of the uh, freeform list over there and then here's our columnar list over there and then if we go back to our list properties we can see that we've checked this auto select layout on orientation change property and we've specified the name of the layout to use for landscape mode and the name of the layout to use for uh, portrait mode so having done that uh, we're all set up now and now when we go to working preview we can see that because the uh, device is now in uh, landscape mode we've chosen the columnar list and then if we were to switch now to vertical you can see that the uh, freeform list is automatically chosen and then of course if we go to the iPad simulator we see the exact same behavior. There's the list that we see for um, landscape and then the list that we see for portrait. So the ability to automatically sense the orientation of the of the device and then choose the appropriate list layout is a very powerful uh, feature in uh, Alpha Anywhere and does not require any programming on your part. Thanks very much for watching.